Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to Starpoint Gemini 2. We just did a story mission. We're supposed to go destroy this star space. I don't know how the hell that's going to work because we barely did that last battle. But, okay, we'll figure this out. Um, can I... I'm gonna collect all. That's a good idea. Let's go PTE. It looks pretty far away, but I can't target it. So I don't know exactly how far it is. Okay, we got some green ships that are definitely on our side. Apparently we're supposed to destroy a star base. Alright, full stop. Now we can target it. Okay, we're just gonna just keep wailing at it, I suppose. I mean, nobody's firing back at us, so we can just sit back and do this, I guess. The hole is slowly going down. Do we have anybody else to worry about here? I don't see... Anything else? Alright, well. Just, uh, keep firing at will, I suppose. We can go nice and slow around it, I guess. But it has no shield, it's just slowly whittling down the hole. It's just that, you know, we can't fire sustained fire because, well, we just don't have the bullets in the railgun, unfortunately. But, uh, it'll just take time. We'll just go through. little unclear why Dimitri wants this thing destroyed, but I'm sure he has a very good reason. It might just be pride. Also, are most of their shots missing? It looks like only, like, maybe like 50% of their shots are actually hitting. I mean, they could be going through, but they could be going for the, uh, the radio towers. There you go. This is how problems are solved. The syndicate will think twice before crossing our paths again. Are you sure about that? Who the hell is this now? Defensive positions. Adrian, leave now. We'll handle this. Now, looks like they have laser weapons. All right, we got to go. We got to go right now. Leave the area. Roger that. I'm out already. Uh, apparently, I need to go that way. So, go that way. They're trying to wreck me. I don't appreciate that. Go, 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 go. Okay, I'm good. All right. Um, might as well just repair the base. We have enough crossroads. I don't think we want to fare anybody just yet, though. What the hell? So those are the story bad guys we need to worry about, I guess. And they didn't look like Syndicate, but I guess they could have been. Syndicate chips are usually different. Okay, here we go. Now that we've obtained all of Faulkner's data cores, the next step is to put that into perspective. Former high-ranking league officers and Gabriel Faulkner's closest allies are likely to be able to help here. Commander Bertrand Steger should be easy to trace. His unique and battle-zealous personality makes him very noticeable. Since the end of the Second War, Steger has been known to be working closely with the Gladius Group. But it is level 10. We're level 8, I think. My father was a good man. And what happened to him will not go unpunished. I will never forget. First step is now accomplished. I have secured all the data cores which contain my father's research from a couple of years back. Majority of files are still heavily encrypted, but several personal logs mention a designated decipher protocol. Only two people had it. Gabriel was one. The other was planted in the computer core of the Damocles, a legendary ship of General Paul Demetrius. The Avalon is now destroyed, and the only chance of decrypting the data is finding the Damocles. But how? It was supposedly destroyed years ago during the final battle of the Second Gemini War, and yet my father's logs indicate he was in contact with his previous associates from the Gemini League, Eleanor Ridley, Bertrand Seeger, and Xavier Morse. It seems not all of them are convinced Demetrius is dead. Apparently they helped my father in his investigation, and they were certain there was something else to the Imperial invasion, and the strange course it took in the years that followed. What is even stranger, father really did know who might attack him. He referred to them as the Brotherhood and it seems as if he intentionally waited for them to make a move. The mysterious group was part of his investigation, and he had to flush them out to verify some of his theories on them. I'm beginning to understand my quest will be much more than revenge. If my father's research is correct, far greater matters are at stake here, and I must see this to the end, regardless of the cost. My father's associates, his inner circle of trusted individuals, are the only ones who are able to help now. It's interesting that he pronounced it Xavier this time and Javier the last time. That's weird, wasn't it? I could have sworn it was Javier Morse before. 
Okay, so we need to be level 10. What are we right now? We're level 8, right? 9. Okay, that's better. Oh, I'm getting fired upon right now? What the hell? Repair. What the hell's the ship at? You're alarming. Um, but that was not the guy who was firing at me. I don't know who was firing at me. Get away from this guy. My ship is mildly on fire right now. Not ideal. Capture marked ship. I mean, maybe? It says reputation minus 20. Why would we want to do that? Oh, this is for the syndicate. Um, no thanks. I don't want to work for the syndicate, thanks. Okay, so we need something to get us to level 10. Let's just, um, what do we need to do? We need to find ourselves in a blue area is a problem. Uh, well, there's a main mission there, but we don't want to do that yet. The problem is avoiding that area until we're ready for it. Okay, let's just GTFO. Yeah, so I think that lines up with our theory that any hex we go into has a job for that area, and it could be anywhere in the star system. Man, I'm leaking plasma like crazy. Still. Or I have plasma on me or something. Uh, my guess is I'm leaking. Oh, alright. Syndicate doesn't like me here. Not too surprising. This is a blue area, though. I'm gonna go to Phoenix. I don't know if I can anchor there or not, but I'd like to. Who are you? You are balanced, theoretically. If there's only one of you, that would be true. If there's more than one... Oh, actually, our plasma went away. Hold up. We'll stop. Oh, actually, let's anchor Phoenix. What the hell? Anchor here. We have troops. Okay, good. Fletcher, how you doing? You have... We don't have any beam weapons. That doesn't help me. Oh, evasion would be good. Sona? I mean... The speed is good. I don't want to. I don't want to dismiss her yet. We cannot hire any mercs yet. It's not too surprising. Sell those. They don't buy ships here. We can repair and rearm. Them. Well, at least we have 600k, but it's going to be a long time before we're able to afford a ship. All right, save a game. Uh, we're on episode nine. Yeah, nine. There it is. Okay. Probably when I do a bunch of episodes in Batch, I'm never exactly sure where I am. Alright. Um, so you have missions for me. You have a mission for assassination. It's level 12. No thanks. Well, 15. Not gonna happen. And we could try the capture. Now it's for the Syndicate, though. Do we want to be better off with the Syndicate? That doesn't sound like a good idea at all. Um, no, let's go... Let's try to clear some of this space and get an idea of what's going on. There's a crossroads mission. We have to go back through Syndicate space, though. Let's go this way. We get stopped, or we get intercepted, I suppose. Not necessarily stopped by a Syndicate ship. Maybe we try to blow it up if it's balanced. That's an asteroid. All right. we travel when we're on the map? I can't tell if it's paused or not. The sounds still go through, so that seems to indicate that it's not. Alright, here we are. What do we got? Oh, you're still level 15. You're still level 12. Okay. Anything good in here, though? There's LaGuardia. Sure, why not? We'll go to LaGuardia. It's a great airport. That's what I hear. Isn't that the one in... Damn, where's LaGuardia Airport? Is that DC? Hold on, full stop. We've got... Ships here. You are... Impossible, alright. And then you guys. You're just traitors, but your threat is deadly. Okay, well, just keep moving. Keep moving. Um... No, whoops. Alright, don't pay attention to the fact that I just fired upon you. Totally accidental. There are missions here, though. 
maintenance, which I can't do. Assassination, which I totally can. We're going to go there first. Let's do it. It says level 7. That is not one of the guys we spotted, as far as I know. It's this threat alarming. I'm a little disturbed by that, but sure. Fire, please. Screw 16, so really it might just be the fact that the gunship is... I don't know. It's weird. Right, that's a hell of a laser shot. Just drain shields like crazy. Wow. Wow. I mean, that's fucking impressive is what it is. I'm not even sure my missiles did anything here. Well, these guys are both alarming, I guess. Yep, they're both alarming. Okay. And we got hit. Maybe I need to be doing these more often. Up my shields if we can. Need my... Yeah, my ship's about to explode. I can't do anything about that. Uh, somebody's trying to help. I appreciate that game. I do. I'm also about to die here. I just blew somebody up. No, not yet. Close, but not yet. They're about to blow me up, though. Yep, there I go. Can't control myself. There I go. Okay. Okay. That was apparently not the right thing to do. I need to be in a better ship. That's clearly what needs to happen. I need to somehow make that happen. How do I do that? Assassination missions are not it. We need to take a safer path. I like blowing stuff up, but you know, sometimes, sometimes you can't do that. Until My you father learn to was grow a good man. Bit. Yes, yes, yes. What yes, happens? Yes. All right. So, with that in mind, maybe we want to do like travel mission or something as a rescue. Ten. I mean, maybe we could do it. It's one level above us. I don't know. They could just blow up again. This is destroy all of our ships. Difficult. I'm gonna try the rescue. I mean, it just seems like we're in a gunship. We should be able to do this. Maybe. Okay, hold up, hold up. Let's anchor. Go to dock. What do we got here? So right now we're still working on the on the base SBR. Maybe we need to up this. Right? Maybe this is not a good loadout for us. So. I, mean, I think still doing a railgun is a good idea because um, that's who our gunner is. We have a Sentinel heavy weapon fusion torpedo. That's kind of neat. Hit points, 500 average damage, 860, which is our current loadout here. We have a Sentinel. Oh, same thing. I thought we had something different here. There's a Blazar. Fusion Torpedo, average armament is 1,450, which is much better, but it also takes most of our cash. Oh, actually, more of the cash than we have. Never mind. Does not work. All right, what about here? So you have an ISIS. Plasma Cannon. Yeah, no, that's not going to work for me. Well, mostly because I can't afford it. The regular one, maybe. Average damage, 100 versus average damage... 18. Yeah, that's quite the difference. Could be the difference between plasma and railgun. Is it worth spending all of the money on? Maybe. If I can't survive anything, it won't matter, right? I can figure these turrets. I can sell them or I can buy them. Why would I want to buy them? I already own them. That's weird. That's the SBR. I already own the SBR. Why would I want to buy them again? Did I misunderstand what this is about? So we've already enhanced these with something here. That enhancement is the XSL. Which only helps us a little bit. I mean, we could select this and then unmount. Okay. Don't see how that helps me. So we have the Sentinel on the ship right now. Is that what's going on? I'm going to sell it. Yeah, this is still unaffected, so... 
present. Okay, the mongoose is still there. Oh, it's a mongoose. Oh. I sold it. Like a big old dummy. Can I get that back? What I should have done was replace it. Son of a biscuit. Okay, now I want a new loadout, please, for dry dock. You have a... You have the sentinel there. And you're going to charge me twice as... Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. No, 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 no. You're not going to do that to me. We're going to load this game. We're going to load it, and we're going to mount it. That's what we're going to do. So I've totally misunderstood that, but we had it in our inventory, so we should be able to just mount it. It's in the dry dock. We should just be able to do it. Having a huge damage weapon like that, or at least relative to what we have now, has got to be helpful. I can only believe My father was helpful. a good man. Yep, 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 yep. Okay. So we go to... I don't know why the music went up really fast. Um, can I leave you for this? That was weird. Okay, anchor back. The music's doing some weird stuff. Okay, anyway, load out. Okay, we're going to switch over to the Blazar. Uh, we can't. We can't mount it. Can we, we unmount this? No. On the Blazar... Very curious. What's going on here? There's a sentinel right there. I want to mount the sentinel. Alright. The mongoose I want to sell. Because it's old and I don't care about it. Okay. That's that's better. Now we've got the sentinel. We need to rearm it. Eight shots for you. Great. Okay. Now. This one. This is going to be a problem. We have nothing in dry dock. So we need to buy it fresh. Um, so can I unmount? Okay, so that's just the bonus there. The actual systems, though. Typhoon, what is this? That's oh, just a bomber. That's cool. Not currently helpful, but cool. So, the ISIS, maybe? I'd rather a railgun. This might not be the place for this. All right. Well, then, if it's not the place for it, let's go find a place for it. Level 7. I don't know if that's true or not. It's not true. How do we How do we judge? I don't think... I don't think maybe that's our problem, is that we don't have... We don't have the right weapons. Is there a... A research station? Doesn't seem like the right place for that. Um, shipyards, though, that could be it. Okay, so let's come up here. I'm gonna go around this so we don't accidentally trigger the mission. Okay, we're definitely not ready for that. That's level 10 mission. We're not ready for that yet. Alright. It's not too far. Oh, we might as well pick this up, whatever this is. Can't target it. No idea what that is. Oh, there it is. Uh, full stop. And then actually go towards that. I'm still not sure what these do. Maybe we need to look at the tutorials and they'll tell us. Uh, we'll stop again. And scan it. Okay, we got experience for it and nothing else. Well, I mean, experience is still good. We'll get us level 10 eventually. Um, I did have a random waypoint and I, so that's not exactly going to help, so go. So, tutorials, hello. Um, basic I don't care about, but I am curious about... Let's see, fleet, cargo, station... I mean, I thought I read through all these, but... Bounty, land of planes, scavenger derelicts... Riftway surfing? Oh, it's called a Riftway. Okay, not called turquoise highways, but that's okay. We're in capturing, mercs, skills, perks, launching fighters. Some ships have a hangar. I don't think we do, but that's pretty cool. 
Um, all right, so nothing on, yeah, we can mine the asteroids using structures. By anchoring on them, right? And plane, bounty board. Okay, well. Nothing exactly about what's going on with the structures here. Okay, what is this? That is, it's LaGuardia, okay. We should be far enough away I can go straight to Hamilton Shipyard here. Yeah, all right. So let's go to Hamilton Shipyard. Completely change direction here. That should be, yeah. Okay, we're not lined up with the mission at all. All right. So that's safe, ish. Do I still have those items? Uh, where the hell, oh, here we go. Items, equipment, nope, we're out of equipment. I guess I used them during the fight. Okay, we need to restock for sure. But that'll wait until after we get a better railgun. Without a better railgun, I think we're just doomed. It's a trouble, I mean, I'm actually thinking over it. I'm a little bit more surprised that we managed to survive as long as we did with starter equipment. We made it to level 9. That's got to be some kind of record. But we should not be going for that record. It's just going to make things harder. Now, the shipyard might just sell ships. It might not sell the right kind of equipment. But it seems like... I mean, they do sell ships. They got the Shanghai. If you've seen those gunships around, they're neat. But they're also, like, a lot weaker than our ship, so I'm not going to care. Okay. What systems do you shell? So we've got the Razor, which is a beam weapon. We've got the Dragoon, which is a plasma cannon. We've got the Magneton, which is a shockwave. No idea. Oh, it's a heavy weapon. All right, not going to help us. Thorn, which is a fighter. Zoex, which is a bomber. Interceptor, rather. Okay. Beam weapons. Beam weapons. I mean, maybe? Right now, the average damage we're doing is like 18. So anything above that is good. Uh, Dragoon is 90. Razor 2 is 34. Now, granted, that just means they don't fire as often, right? The rate of fire is 0.8. Rate of fire is 0.2, yeah. So this fires a lot more often. But it does more damage per hit. Which maybe is what we want. I'm not wild about plasma weapons, because our gunner right now is specifically for rail guns. But it's time to move on, right? It's time to move up in the world. So we can afford the Dragoon 3. And maybe that's exactly what we do. I mean, I like plasma. I like lasers, too. Lasers seem to drain the hell out of the shield, so that's not bad, either. Um, that is a beam weapon. 34 is not that great, though. And Dragoon's the only one that actually gets level 3. Now, it could be we just can't afford... Like, maybe the Razor 2 is great. 34, ready to fire 2, energy cost 1, 1. Range is 500, Dragoon 3. Range is 720. It looks like the plasma weapons have a really good range. So I'm going to buy this one. It's going to cost us a lot, but I think it's worth it. Okay, just the one. Thanks. Okay, then go to our loadout. And... The Dragoon, I would like to mount. Okay. Now, the thing is, it says three... I don't know. Configure it. And we've already got one, so I don't know why. It says current 3, max 2. I, I don't get this. I don't understand what that means. Okay, so then go to enhancement, or sorry, go to systems and sell this. Because it's junk. Go to enhancements. Don't we still have an Artemis enhancement in here? Or does that not count anymore? Um, well, it's light weapon. I thought we had an Artemis 3 or something, but now I don't see it. It could be by unmounting it, I made it not available. Or it was only available for the, uh, for the railgun. So let's save the cash there. And instead go over to officers. And now our gunner... Yeah, only affects railguns on two of his abilities. So that's not good. We need to find a better gunner. Uh, none of these guys are gunners, so that doesn't help me at all. So, let's save this, now that we've got this new setup going. 
We are still in episode nine, so save. Okay, we should be doing more damage now. We should be able to actually get things going. So, that's level 14. That's not going to happen. Um, we need to find a mission that's going to help us. We have no idea what's in these sectors of space. So let's go through this. If I do that, that should get us once we actually pass the shipyard. Okay, surprisingly did not bounce on anything. Kind of expected to be able to do that, but no. Okay. So now we got brand new weapons. We're loaded up to bear. We got a Dragoon. Average damage 170, which is actually better than I thought. And a Sentinel. Okay, actually the damage seems to have gone up. Is here for the cargo? Um, full stop. I'm kind of tempted to let him try. It says deadly. Maybe I don't let him try. Nah, keep going. I don't think we're ready for deadly yet. PT. I thought we were, but if he's deadly still, then no. What do you got here? 14, not gonna work out for me. 10? Maybe? Fuck it, let's try it. Let's try it. We've saved recently. Last dock, so why not? Aside from, you know, the fact that we might die horribly. Aside from that. Aside from minor problems like that. Minor issues. They're still coming after me? Holy shit, these guys are determined. No, okay, there we go. They might have gotten distracted by somebody else, though. So. I wonder if there's a way to pull anybody out of PTE. Probably by draining their engines, right? But that means you need a hell of a shot. Which isn't always going to happen. And we just need, just need a better ship. We just need to be able to pick off something here. Need to make it work. Okay, here we go. Target. Okay, target is weak. I like that. And full stop. Fire it well. Okay, the plasma shot is awesome. Whoa, he just got wrecked. That destroyed him. All right. Um, that was easy. Uh, that's a waypoint. Don't do that. Freelance. That's level 14. Probably not. Okay, so that was weak, right? I don't think that was indicative, but it was cool. Let's go here. Just trying to explore all the... Well, maybe not all, but a good amount of unknown to us hexes. And hopefully we'll be able to get some missions to actually help us out. And there are missions down here. Assassination. 12. Come on, guys. You know, the game knows what level I am, right? And the missions seem to respawn roughly every day. I think every time this ticks or something. I don't know. What is that? Looks like a station of some kind. What is that? AMP Sanctuary. All right. You say so, but... We should be... Yeah, we're in a new sector now. Okay, McAllister 1 dead or alive. Let's do it. Let's go. If we can capture a ship, that's the ideal. That's what I want to be able to do. Alright, there's two ships here. Threat is weak. Alright, fire. Let's go, 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 go. Um, here, target this guy. This threat is balanced, so that's good. I want to be able to capture that ship. Send over some crew. At least find the other guy. Now, the boarding party doesn't seem like it went very well. Let's try hacking. Try to decrease their effectiveness. Now, it didn't seem to work out very well. Yep, boarding failed. No more troopers. All right. Uh, that ship looks in bad shape. So we can make it worse. Plasma seems to not be working here. I'm taking some serious hits. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Damn it, I'm going to explode. We're doing so well, too. I have no energy. I'm trying to regain some of my shields here. Show my port side there. 
I have like no health. This is bad. This is very bad. Oh shit! No! 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 no. Don't! No! Damn it! I spent too much time focusing on the boarding party and not enough time on the destruction. Let's try that again. Except, you know, without the death and destruction. Well, death and destruction on my part. They're going to be death and destruction on their part. Maybe what I need to do to make the boarding party work is get the health of the ship down to a certain amount. Like maybe, I don't know, let's say 10%. And then focus. Yeah, that could work. We need something that, de that definitely... My father was a good man. Yes, yes, I know he was. All right. We've done everything else here, right? This is still working? Yeah, okay, we still got the dragon. Okay. Just making sure it wasn't saved before. I did something crazy. All right, so go this way. We're going to get a different set of missions, which should be fine. Yep, flip all the way around. Do all your nonsense until you get over there. That's fine. Okay. I think we could have totally handled that if I wasn't so focused on the boarding. I wasn't even I wasn't even looking at the shields. By the time I looked at the shields, it was already too late. I mean, everything's obvious and right in front of me. There's no reason for me to hard focus on one part of the screen. But that's exactly what I do. I do that all the time. I do that in movies. I do that whenever I watch movies. It's like, oh, did you see this thing in the background? Dude, I was too focused on like the actual people talking that I, I just don't have the mental processing power to handle that. I always focus on like one part of the screen. It's usually where the cursor is. Wherever the cursor is, that's where my that's where my focus is. Um, sometimes I'll actually look down and do stuff, but most of the time it's wherever the cursor is pointing. That's where my eyes are looking. You can assume that anything else is I'm completely oblivious to. It's very far away, but that's okay. What do we got here? We got a uh, maintenance. Can't do that. Assassination. Okay, looks like we're up again. Let's try this. Level 8. One level below us. Should be totally doable. Again, we're going to try to capture a ship. Threat is weak. Alright. The trouble is I'm a bad shot. This is why I do focus fire here. For target. I'm going to try to lock onto him. We're not going to hit him too hard. I'm going to hit him as hard as you like, but also rotate so we can get a couple of our turrets actually in line here. I want to make sure we're not going up against a full crew if we can. We're going up against only like 10 guys when we send our boarding party over. Oh shit. Nope, that just destroyed him. Alright, well, so much for that. We'll stop. Might as well collect it then. I mean, it worked, which is good, but he died horribly. All right, let's try this one over here. That one, I think, is level seven, which means they'll probably be weak to us too, but sure. Though it's the first time we've seen weak, or is it? No, we've seen weak before. It's just they were also in a mixture of, I think they were a mixture of weak and impossible, which is quite the range. But seeing as our rail guns were not all that good, that kind of makes sense. Uh, we probably want to stop at something. Maybe the... We don't want to do the ferry. I definitely don't want to do the ferry. But... Maybe like we go to Plymouth Shipyard or someplace. Some place with a good gunner. We just need to replace our gunner. Our gunner right now really likes rail gun weapons. He's not totally on board with this whole new... Newfangled plasma stuff. So... Figured out. Alright, this guy is also weak. Which is good for us. Uh, full stop. Open fire. Alright, we want to lock onto this guy now. Now, there's only one of them, which means capture is a possibility. That was a good volley. He also has plasma weapons, it looks like. By staying on this side, we're able to keep our focus, I guess. I'm tempted to... I keep being tempted. You know what? Fine. We'll do here. Okay, he's not blowing up yet. 
Because we're in a board. Ten of our guys. We just need to keep moving around. Move our guys over. There's two of him left. Come on. Take him out. Take him out. Take him out. Okay. This should be our ship soon. He's alone, so this should just be it, right? He just hit me there, bastard. Come on. There we go. It's our ship now. Huzzah. And we leveled up on it, too. Okay, I'm tempted to sell it. What kind of ship is this? I don't even know. Um, it's a Lyra ship. I don't know what that means. Okay, let's go sell it. There's a Plymouth shipyard over here. They'll probably give us a good price. Hopefully. It's funny, when I hover over it, nothing is actually there. Grappled ship too far. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Full stop. That didn't work. What the hell? It worked last time. Didn't it? All right, go over back to the ship. Um, need to, I thought we had to select it. It is selected. Why can't I go to it then? Don't demolish it. Can't do info. Just go there. PTE. No idea what the hell I just got credits for, but sure. Full stop. Okay. Let's try that again. Grapple the ship. All right. Apparently grappling makes it go out to like a certain distance. We can loot the ship, apparently. Um, all right, boarding successful, it has systems. Should definitely take the cloak disruptor. We should take all their commodities. Quick loot, which I can just take stuff. But I also want to take the ship. I'm going to move with the ship, all right? Let's go. So, full speed. Um, okay. No, it's hanging at two something. All right. Maybe my problem was I was going immediately to PTE. Possibly. Okay. I know we've done this before. Okay, I want to go here. Right, go PTE. Here we go. Damn it. Full stop. Full stop. You're telling me you need to go at sublight speeds. That's insane. But I think that is what they're telling me. But we've done this before. I've towed a guy at PTE. What the hell is the difference here? I don't want to demolish it. Okay. I mean, we can go at sublight. It's just stupid. But sure. Anything else in the region? It's a little bit faster. At this point, no. I think we're close enough to the shipyards. I think just how it goes. All right, let's just go then. It's just going to be hella slow, but... Oh, I didn't mean to fire the gun there. All right, where is this thing at? Um, over there. Okay, that's not actually that far. It's 3,000. We can make that. It's just weird that PTE doesn't appear to be a thing. I could have sworn that worked last time. Maybe that's why I didn't let us keep the money when we re reloaded the save, is that for some reason it didn't actually register as being actually attached to our sh I don't know. I'm making shit up. I have no idea. But this time I want to add it to the garage before we sell it. Assuming we can do one of those things. Maybe they're only going to give us one option. Maybe it's just going to be scrap it or demolish it or whatever. But I'm kind of curious what kind of ship it is. We need to be able to compare and all that good stuff. Do not let us do that now. Okay, yeah, anchor at Plymouth. So full stop. Anchor. Okay, here we go. So this ship is apparently worth 128,000 credits. It's a gunship, obviously. That's an okay hull. Let's put it in the garage. And now we have a garage here. Oh, now we have a new tutorial. All right. You can store multiple ships in your garage for later use to transfer command or sell the ship. Okay. The left side is reserved for a list of your stored ships, while the right side shows detailed info on the selected ship. Much like the shipyard panel in the garage, also features the compare tab to compare the current ship with your, your selected ship with your current ship. 
Use the stats and systems tab to change what information you're looking over. Try to command the selection ship by pressing the traffic command button. Okay. Now, is this... Oh, this looks like a fighter. Only carries 12 troopers. Okay, so it's not great. We could just sell it. I would love is if we could take this ship and say, you're now our wingman. And have a fleet following us or whatever. That'd be fantastic. But unfortunately, that doesn't seem to be a thing. Yeah, it's far weaker than our current ship. Alright, maybe we just sell it right now? Transferring command seems stupid. So I'm just going to sell it. I mean, it's good to have this warning. So I'm going to have this warning pop up every time just because it's safer. Okay, in terms of crew. Our gunner. You're good with beam weapons. Um, so that doesn't help me. Alright. Give me some more troops. Unfortunately, those troops are going to talk. So, you know, they're going to find out exactly what's wrong. Adhara. Okay, Corvette is definitely on the list of things to buy. 950 is not too bad. We could do that. If we remember to capture ships. And that's the tricky bit. I'm going to get on... Okay, I'm good on hull and I'm good on ammo. So we're good. I should save. Because we did just get a payday. There you go. Alright. Okay. Missions. What do we got? Don't care about maintenance. Don't care about ferry. Um, we could go looking for trouble. Okay, there's an empty space right here. I don't know what this is, so we're going to go there. Yeah, go around the shipyard. What we could do is go mining. It's a very relaxing activity. Could do it. Well, assuming, of course, that, you know, pirates don't want to come over and eat our face. But, you know, aside from that, I guess they're not reapers. They're not going to eat our face. They're just going to shoot us in the face and then steal all of our stuff. Because, you know, pirates. Hmm. All right. Well, I mean, that's one way to get a ship. I mean, that's a 100,000 credit payday right there. Plus, on top of that, we had the actual money for the assassination. Plus, the money for was actually on board the ship. We didn't actually sell. I totally forgot to open the trading dialogue. But that's still pretty good maintenance I don't care about. We need a repair bay. I would like to repair bay. Let's go here and see. Or repair beam, rather. Let's see what these guys have. If they have a gunner who actually is good with plasma weapons, that'd be great. Okay, what do you got? Okay, let's trade first off. Let's sell the stuff. There you go. Hey, we're in 300Ks again. That's good. Oh, don't do that. Do this. All right, we do have two gunners here. We have Luke, who's good with heavy weapons. And we have Janice, who's good with beam weapons. And much as I like that, guys, um, not really what I'm looking for today. We have Flo here, who actually increases smuggling chance. That's hilarious. Increases mining yields and salvage value. Well, Sonia, what do you do for me? I mean, if I had a fleet, he'd be good. But I don't. And I'm not currently in a freighter or freight liner vehicle. Why do I have you? <laughs> it doesn't do me any good. I think we're going to trade over for flow. At least that actually gives me some possible stuff. Alright, Sona. Sorry, but um, we're going to have to let you go. And flow, welcome to the team. Okay, troopers were set. Mercs we cannot hire yet, surprisingly. Or not surprisingly, I suppose. Alright. We're good? We're good. Let's, uh, let's, of course, save the game, because we just made a radical change there. Alright. I think we have a shot now. I think my problem was that we weren't upgraded. And now that we are, hopefully we're in good shape. So let's go here. We'll do one more sector, just to look around. Apparently, our pilot is a little drunk. It's okay. Anybody who uh, managed to lose their lunch, please talk to the pilot. Pilot's new name is Flo. She says you need to go with the Flo. She thinks it's funny. She says it every time. And everyone kind of hates her for it. But, you know. They also love her for it, too. Because, you know, she says it even in the middle of battle. And at that point, it's more comforting than annoying. So, you know, you... You take a little, you give a little. 
All right, we're in the middle of bad space. Don't stop here for anything. Keep going. Thought we were gonna just do one more, but this might all be red to us. Is that a new mission over there? That is an assassination mission. Sure, you know what? Let's over that way. It's gonna take us a little bit longer. It means that episode's gonna go on a little long, but that's okay. What are you? You are deadly. And of course, the star base there. Okay, so eventually, eventually, what I'm thinking what's gonna happen, we're gonna have a big enough ship, we're gonna be able to take on star bases with no problems. And our job, should we choose to accept it, would be to wipe out all of these red guys. I don't know if we're later gonna replace them with anything, but our job, eventually, maybe in 20 episodes, maybe in 40, I don't know how long it's gonna take, but our job is to get a big enough ship where that could be a possibility. Now, it might just take us forever. I mean, this, this star system is huge, all right? We don't even know where the star is. We see it in the distance. Oh, here it is. It's over here. It's probably down here. But, I mean, look at this thing. We've only explored maybe... I don't know. A quarter of the map? A quarter might be right. I mean, it's only episode 10 and a quarter of the map. So, I mean, balance that out. But, it's also going to be a while till we're level 10. What are we right now? We are... Okay, we are actually level 10. I'm actually kind of surprised. I didn't realize. Okay, so maybe we need to focus on the story mission then, which is up here? Where's the story mission at? Oh, there it is, down there. Now we'll deal with it. Okay, so we're gonna blow these guys up. We're gonna go dock so we can save, and then that's gonna be the end of the episode. Hopefully, 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 cross your fingers, cross your toes, cross your legs, cross your nose. I only said that because it rhymes, otherwise it doesn't make any damn sense. How do you even cross your nose? We're gonna try to capture the ship. They are weak. That's a good sign. I like weak ships because that means we have a chance. Fire at will. Also at Bob, Charlie, and whoever else you got. Since they're in range, grab them. Oh, they blew up. That was fast. They just exploded into a ball of fire. All right. Uh, turns out firing at will, a little difficult. A little difficult to make that work. Uh, level 11. Scan the marked anomaly. Why would scanning an anomaly be level 11? I'm going to go there purely. Well, that was really fast, wasn't it? Yeah, I mean, it's right there. We'll just scan the anomaly. If anybody tries to stop us, we'll try to blow them up. But it doesn't look like we're taking any damage, really. I mean, static is all hell, but that's different. Such a scrambler, that's what it is, alright. As soon as we get within 300, we'll do a full stop. I can't tell. There we go. We're done. And... I mean, as soon as we understand it, we should be able to filter it out. And that appears to be exactly what just happened. Alright, go there. And we will anchor... Oh, we'll stop. Anchor up. And good to go, I guess. Go and sell all that good stuff there. We didn't have a chance to get our troopers over, so there you go. Nada. Nada compared to Gavin. I mean, the shield strength is good. EMP resistance is good too. Ship system repair speed also pretty good. Shield recharge plus five percent, and you've got shield strength, which is different. I think that means basically we take less damage on the shields. Or is this recharges the shield? So you know what? Gavin, you've been good to us, but goodbye. Nada, welcome to the team. And, okay. That'll do it. Thank you guys for watching. This has been Starship Gemini 2. I'm Peace Universe, you're Peace Universe 2, and I'll see you guys next time.